If you're a woman training consistently and not taking creatine, you're probably leaving some strength and performance gains on the table. First of all, what is creatine? Simply put, creatine is a naturally occurring compound in the body that you can also get from eating meat and seafood. It helps regenerate ATP, which is your body's main energy source during high intensity activity, such as sprinting and lifting. Did you know that women naturally have way less creatine stores than men? This means that we benefit even more from supplementation. Now I wanna answer some questions that I hear a lot. Number one, is it safe? Yes, this is one of the most well-researched supplements in the world and it is very safe for healthy individuals for long-term use. Number two, I don't wanna get huge, so why do I need it? Totally fair concern, but creatine is not just for male bodybuilders. You will not get bulky from creatine. What it does do is help you train more effectively, perform better, recover faster, and maintain lean muscle, which is especially important as we're aging. Number three, probably the most common, does it cause bloating? Most people do not experience bloating, and if they do, it is only temporary. Creatine draws water into your muscle cells, which is actually a good thing and that's a lot different than water retention underneath the skin. Number four, what kind should I get? Nothing fancy here, just plain old creatine monohydrate. Have you ever seen these non-bloating creatine supplements? No, we don't need that. And number five, do I have to do a loading phase? A loading phase is when you take a large amount of creatine to get your muscles saturated faster. The truth is this isn't necessary. I just recommend for my clients to take three to five grams daily. After a few weeks, your muscles will get saturated just the same. Let me know if there's something you want me to break down next.